All right. Right now on the phone, we got Scott and Peter. We're talking Go Cleanse. How's it going today, guys? Doing great. Thanks, guys. Fabulous. Thanks, guys. Awesome. Well, we just finished up our cleanse. We actually did it. We didn't even kill each other, which uh, which was a big concern of ours at first. But uh, I, I will say, when you know, going through the first few days, it was kind of tricky, and it really does kind of put you in a different place. You you know, you're you're switching the way you're eating and things like that. But uh, overall, Chow, we had some really good results with this. Yeah, we did. I lost nine pounds. I lost fifteen. So we, <laughs> yeah, we dropped some serious weight. So for those that don't know, we did the eleven day cleanse. Why don't you guys just explain what exactly is happening during this 11-day cleanse period? Well, I guess I'll take it as a nerdy scientist. Basically, what's happening is that you're transforming your body from a primarily sugar-burning machine basically into a fat-burning machine. And the whole point is, and why diets are so tricky for people is, we know that the body accumulates toxins in water, air, food, carpets, shampoos, whatever, and the body stores them in fat cells. No amount of diet or exercise gets rid of them. And what the GoCleanse system is based on is really on empowering the body to get rid of this toxic fat. And as you do that, that's why you guys lost so much weight. And by the way, you didn't lose muscle mass. You didn't lose water, water weight. You actually lost fat, this toxic fat that we all have in our body it's called obesogen. And so over the course of that nine days, you actually were transforming your body from one that was primarily storing toxins to one that was beginning to naturally, the body is doing this, it's burning those fat cells in which the toxins are stored. And then the go cleanse, the technologies we use, break those toxins down and make them harmless so they can pass out through the body without any side effects at all. And that's why you lost, as we've seen thousands and thousands of people do, lose more weight in a few days than most people can lose in maybe two months of diet and exercise. So that's kind of the shortest version I can give you as to what's going on. But you're not on a diet, as you two experience. You're basically cleansing your body. And one of the great side benefits of that is tremendous safe weight loss. Well, and, you, and, and, you know, to kind of sum that up, like, I, I'll tell you one thing that, like Peter said, I mean, we're now approaching 200,000 people over the last nine years that have gone through our program. And uh, I always put it this way to folks, that we're just, the body just is getting to operate more efficiently and effectively, cleansing it of all those toxins and impurities. It's just easier for the body to, absorb water, absorb proteins, absorb, absorb the foods that we put in our body. So our body's just operating better. And anybody who will, who will tell you, yeah, the weight loss is great, that I'm sure you guys experience the same thing, that it, it's a side benefit is what it is. What, what most folks do is I have so much more energy, I sleep better. You know, why does that happen? And to just sum it up real simply, like I said, the body's just operating at a very high level as we get rid of those toxins and fill it with these massive amounts of nutrition. So that's my simple take on it there without the uh, uh, nerdy science side. <laughs> Yeah, and that's one thing we actually both noticed throughout the whole entire process was we were getting better sleep, and it's kind of crazy how, you know, when you go through a cleanse like this and you get it, you get all the toxins out of your body, how it affects something as simple as sleep. Now, you must hear that from a lot of people then, right? Everybody. I mean, literally everybody. Across the board. Yeah, across the board. To just tell us how much better in general they feel. People, again, I'm in my 50s now. Hear people in their 50s and 60s saying, I haven't felt this good since I was in my 20s. Because, again, we're giving the body a full oil change, basically, to get it started operating uh, uh, better. And, again, I want to emphasize, it's not a diet. It has nothing to do with dieting. This is really about being able to get into your body massive amounts of nutrients in the fewest calories possible. This has nothing to do with counting calories or any of the stupid things that are out there. This is basically a detoxification process that's naturally occurring in your body because you're supplying with what it needs in order to carry out that process naturally. It's not this technology that's detoxing you. It's your own body doing it. That's why it's so safe and why so many doctors recommend it. Yeah, and the thing about it is this world, uh, I've heard you guys say this before, we pretty much live in a toxic world at this point. Everything is bad for you, essentially. I mean, even sometimes just having a cup of water out of your faucet could just be really just have a lot of chemicals and just weird stuff in it that you don't even realize. So since we just finished a cleanse period just a few days ago, how long should a person wait until they're to do this type of thing again? Okay, well, one of the, I guess, misnomers of what we call in, call in with a diet, the cleansing process, the deep cleansing process, I mean, folks can folks can do this for 30, 60, you know, 90 days straight if they want to. You know, whenever you feel your body 
hey, you know, whether you want to lose a little weight, whether you're just feeling a little sluggish, you know, that'll tell you. I cleanse about every six weeks. I do a two-day, sometimes an 11-day cleanse. But once you get to a goal weight or where you're feeling good, the maintenance program is what this is about. It's literally a lifestyle change. The maintenance program is just a shake in the morning, a shake in the evening, and, uh, you know, eating healthier. I mean, I, you, you may have noticed something where you're craving things. A lot of folks, I was a big sweet tooth, and we hear this from a lot of people where it's like, I, I just had to have my candy bars. I had to have something with sugar in it to get me going, or the caffeine. That's another big one that, that a lot of folks live with. And when the body's operating effectively, I don't need my caffeine. Water, my body craves more water. Sweet, yes, I still have my uh, candy bars once in a while, and so on, but it's not something my body's living off of that sugar. And uh, Peter can, you know, explain that a little more what's happening during that process. But this is literally a lifestyle change, not like just a cleanse. I'm going to do 11 days here and then in, uh, you know, three months do it again. It's okay to do that. That's fine. But the full maintenance is that weight will stay off and your body will keep operating effectively. And Peter, you're a pretty much a self-proclaimed nerd. I've heard uh, I've heard you say that many right. times, many yeah. times at this point. So tell me what net protein utilization is, because I've heard you throw this term around before. What exactly is that? Yeah, well, see, here's the fallacy that most people have. They think they eat healthy by doing organic, et cetera. And as you guys know, in my lecture, I talked about the fact that, you know, today you've got to eat nine oranges to equal one orange from a while ago. So our food is really lacking in nutrients. But here's what net protein utilization is. So let's just say, you know, you're, you're in shape and you're, you're eating lean chicken, fish, you're doing protein shakes, you know, whatever. Well, there's a, there's a scientific measurement out there. It's called the net protein utilization. Now, what does it mean? It's broken into two categories. One is absorption. So what your body has to do when you eat a protein, it has to break it down. It has to actually absorb the protein into the body. Now, let me give you some numbers. For example, when you would eat a typical uh, protein shake, it would be 95% absorption. When you eat a steak or chicken or fish, it's about 73% absorption. But that's not what you care about. What you care about is that's why it's called utilization. It's the utilization of amino acids, which are in the protein, which are the most critical thing. Now, here are the shocking numbers. That same whey protein that you're taking that has an absorption of 95%, amino acid utilization is only 15%. A steak is around 25%. Chicken, fish, they're all about the same. So here we are thinking we're eating healthy by eating, you know, our organic chickens or, or beef or whatever it is, and less than only a, a quarter or less of the amino acids are actually getting to the cells. But here's the downside. 75% of what's not utilized is turned into waste, which is called urea or creatine. Now, the shakes that we use within the GoCleanse system, this has been researched and proven by a third party outside, did the analysis on this. The net protein utilization of these shakes that you guys have been taking is 91%, which means only 9% is waste. So I would ask you on a daily basis, behind door number one is a steak or chicken, whatever, at 25% utilization and 75% waste. Behind door number two, at least for one or two of your meals a day, here's one of these shakes at 91% net protein utilization and a 9% waste. You two are smart guys. Which door do you choose? I'm choosing door number two. Bingo. That's it. See, and so when I get this question, which makes my hair light on fire, you guys have never seen me get, well, I guess you did see me excited in the lecture, but I get crazy <laughs> when people say, do I have to do this for the rest of my life? Let's go back to the two questions. Okay, folks, behind door number one, you have 25% amino acid utilization and 75% waste, which, by the way, puts a strain on your kidneys and your liver. Behind door number two, you have 91% utilization with only 9% waste. Do you think maybe at least one of your meals a day should be one of these shakes or not? Or do you think it's good that everything you eat is 75% waste? Well, which which door do you want to choose again? I'm taking that door that's got those shakes oh, yeah. all day, every day. <laughs> there you go. And that's why you'd want to continue on this. That is, that's the game changer. And, guys, honestly, I only found this out in the last two weeks. Literally within the last two weeks, this molecular biologist did this analysis, and he was shocked because he was literally using with his patients a a, just an undenatured whey protein from New Zealand, the best protein in the world. And the net protein utilization of that was only 15%. These super shakes, which have been enhanced at 91%, guess what he did? All of his patients, his friends, his colleagues, he switched them all over to at least one of these shakes a day. Damn. And you know what? Now that we're talking about these shakes again, it's just flashing me back to, you know, drinking them, and I miss them. I really do. <laughs> there you go. You're in withdrawal. <laughs> no, your, your genes and your cells miss them. Because, and, and if you remember, I talked about this in the lecture. See, food is fats, carbs, and protein, but it's food's job is to carry genetic information to our gene. 
So imagine if you're only transferring 25% of the amino acids potential, and amino acids are the single most important thing for our bodies, and 75% is unutilized. Can you imagine when you give your body, that's why you guys, that's why you're sleeping better, because you got 91% of the amino acids that are doing their jobs in your body. Yeah, absolutely. And you could tell, we could tell during that cleanse, and even now, now that I got that out of me, I just feel, I feel a lot better about myself for one, and my body feels really good. So this is the nerdy scientific explanation, and here's what I would say. How would you argue against that? What would be your argument? Whatever you were eating before, how would you argue against that? And I'm only saying just do one shake a day, like Scott and I, we do two shakes a day. But even one shake a day is a game changer because you're getting 91% of the amino acids that you need versus 25% or 30%. The highest on the, on the protein scale is an egg, and it's at 40%. Still 60% of an egg, sorry, Rocky, is waste. 60%. <laughs> From an amino acid standpoint. And that's the only thing you care about, the amino acids, which is what's in the protein. That's why you ingest protein in the first place. People, they think they're having bacon eggs for breakfast or sausage or they're having a hot dog at lunch or a hamburger. Nice try. Nice try. 75% waste. And it sounds to me those people well, are on the, they're on the fast track to a heart attack, it sounds like, you know, if they're eating all that. Yes. Yes. Well, that's part of it, too. But Peter says that, uh, 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 well, and this is the one that uh, I'm sure from the event you'll, you'll know what Peter starts out with, is food will never be enough again. If you truly want your body to operate, you know, more optimally, Food will never be enough. The same apple that you eat today, you have to eat well, an equivalent of 12 of them today that you did just one apple back 35 years ago. That's how the nutrition value in our food supply. I mean, that's just one example. There's hundreds of them. But food can never be enough again, and that's why even that one shake in the morning replaces breakfast what, or whatever meal you want to replace. All that dense nutrition gets in your body and half the vitamins, nutrients, minerals, everything else in your body in one simple shake. Done. We need yeah. to get back on Go Cleanse, Chow. This is making me feel terrible. <laughs> we just got off of it. Well, let's just, <laughs> let's just hold our horses a little bit because it was pretty difficult. But before we let you guys go, I, I think this is one of the most important things to reinforce about Go Cleanse. When people hear cleanse, they usually think, Okay, when is a good time to do this going to be? Because, I mean, I'm going to be running in and out of the bathroom at work. It's going to disrupt my life and everything. But you guys have already mentioned this. It's not a diet, and it's not a colon cleanse. And I think that's just something that's really important for people to understand because it doesn't disrupt your daily habits or your daily routine at all. You really don't even notice that you're actually even doing it. And then the 11 days pass by, and you're like, well, I'm a better version of myself. Right. The biggest, myth, the biggest misnomer out there is our coaches, which uh, the other part of Go Cleanse is our coaching support system and everything, where you have someone you can call. Every one of our cleansers has somebody that they can text, they can email, they can call on the phone, get a hold of ask questions. And the number one question of most people talking, how many times a day am I going to be going to the bathroom? No, this is not a colon cleanse. This is deep at a cellular level. Now, you're going to be drinking a lot of water and everything else, and that's how the toxins actually flush out the system through the, through the kidneys. So other than that, this is not a colon cleanse. The biggest, biggest question, number one question we have. So uh, you're, you're right uh, there. I mean, you will not be disrupting your daily, uh, daily life, that's for sure. Yeah, and that was really convenient. Now, for those that want to get Go Cleanse, What's the best way to go about getting this product if someone wants to try it? Uh, the, 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 the best will look good two ways. One, you go to gocleanse.net. Uh, uh, go to gocleanse.net. Right there, you can submit an order right there with it. The coach will uh, get a hold of you and, uh, you know, complete the order for you, set you up with the coaching and everything. Otherwise, our main number is uh, 866-867-5512. Again, 866 866- All right, Scott and Peter from Go Cleanse. We have tried it. It is a great. We didn't try it. We did it. We did it. We completed (laughs) it. And, you know, it really. Congratulations, by the way. Thank you. Thank you. And you know what? It really does make you kind of a better person going through that because, you know, we do bar events and stuff like that. And it really, it not only makes you feel better as a person, but it really builds up some willpower. It does. Yep. It definitely does. Well, thanks so much, guys, for everything, for all the help during our cleanse and and just for making this product because I feel like it definitely opened our eyes to not only, you know, nutrition on how to properly eat, but just what it truly means to be healthy and not have a bunch of poison inside of you. So we definitely recommend this to everybody. And thanks for chatting with us today, guys. Good hearing it from you again. Thank you very much. Yeah, thanks for spreading the word there, guys. We really appreciate that.